<laughs> all right you guys and uh i made a video right before this one and when i got out of here i forgot what i was gonna make a video of <laughs> so i just kind of rambled uh about the the new toro uh i made a video of it and uh the end end part of the summer just before fall when i went and bought it and was talking about it uh i have tried it because we did get snow uh we got six inches overnight uh, and i did try it it is an outstanding machine um real easy to work i mean very very user friendly very user friendly uh i would honestly say there almost is no going wrong with them um uh, joystick control is real smooth um, for those that is in <laughs> the um, distance you know if you want your machine to throw 40 feet or whatever um, buy one that's all I gotta say <laughs> uh, it is scary um, I've had other Toros. Uh, got the little Craftsman here. You know, uh, it was lacking a little bit in, in some departments, but it, it it did really well and got the job done really nice. Uh, I think I had a video of it on the uh, deflector was cracked. Uh, one other problem with these by the guard that goes on it. Uh, and cover the muffler because it makes for a real bad day you know if you're like me you like blowing snow I, mean, I do I actually enjoy it with a good working machine um, I go look for snow to blow uh, I blow all the way around the house uh, about 30 feet away from the house uh, mostly in the backyard <laughs> but anyway um, makes for a real bad day when you go to adjust it and the muffler is right there if it's turned this way you go to reach in here and you hit the muffler to loosen that nut see uh, you have to reach over like this and to adjust it um, I have owned this machine for I don't know how long and again tonight I touched a muffler <laughs> uh, it's just one of those things you never learn <laughs> uh, but you know this one you don't have that problem anyway uh, for anybody that wants to see like I said we got six inches uh, in places four and other you know it just depends on how it drifts we've got up to nine inches in places my backyard has between eight and nine inches in it of uh snow uh anyone wants to see a blowing video let me know of either one i've got my other blowers on the back of my plow truck uh and in the video before this i told about the transfer case going out in the truck uh it's got an appointment to go into the doctor and uh, to put a new transfer case in it the uh, the chain in the transfer case started slipping so i'm not going to repair it i'm just going to put a new one in it or let dodge put a new one in it um paddles this is what i was going to show on the single stage blowers i've seen some videos of people making them and i've made a whole lot of them for people this is the one off of it this is on mine my personal I have a uh, four cycle yard machine uh, I had a couple of the little Toro two two strokes two cycles 
really don't like them that much just because they sound like a pissed off bee or something when they're running and I got a lot of accounts with people and I head out at two in the morning three four you know anywhere in there I don't want to disturb people if I can help it but they want the snow gone so they can go to work this is an old conveyor belt um, this is the one off of the machine after a couple seasons well, you can see how the edge is feathered and it's wore at an angle and feathered back the conveyor belt here is what I make them out of um, this is the replacements let's see how thick that one is compared to that one there it's got three layers of a cord the nylon cord in it with about a quarter inch of rubber on one side and probably about a sixteenth on this side um, this is a cut from the outside of the conveyor well right there okay the center of a conveyor belt is thinner it's not as thick because they lay like this and uh, grain sets in the center and it runs it up into a truck or whatever um, there's a lot of farmers around here and they're changing these out so I'm more than happy to give them to you to get it out of the way so I never run out uh, the uh, but that's what I put on the little single stage. Uh, you walk out to the back of the truck and maybe we'll show it to you. You probably can't see the paddles, but uh, you'll see the machine I'm talking about. It's just the little yellow and green. Uh, you can't really see it. Single stage yellow and green four cycle blower uh, they're real good uh, for a one man deal uh, I can plow and jump out and throw the blower off and blow the sidewalks and such as I need to most of the time I shovel them uh, I've got a snow shovel I don't know if anybody's heard of them it's called the plow uh, it's really wide it's about four feet wide and it's not straight it's set in an angle so you just get behind it and walk and it's just like a plow it throws it off to one side um, it's like a $80 snow shovel <laughs> which is no shoveling to it it's set on such a pitch that you can you literally cannot shovel with it uh, but yeah, yeah. Anyone who wants to see a video of them, uh, I'll make them anyway. Of them blowing. Uh, let me know. Comment, subscribe, rate it. All right, guys. Till the next one.